Hey honey bunches, just before we get into the video, I wanted to say that two new things are on my Etsy. They're really exciting. They are quick vegan lunches posters that would be great in your on your fridge or in your kitchen as wall art. Um, there's an A4 one with six vegan recipes and an A3 one with 12 vegan recipes. They're new ones I haven't shared and they're designed to be quick, easy and answer that question of what the heck do I make for lunch? So vegan barbecue recipes, yum yum. Without the meat, how are we gonna go? Um, well, we're gonna go pretty good. And first up, I'm gonna show you how to make this creamy potato and dill salad which is heavenly it's not too rich it's refreshing and without the dairy right girls yep phoebe you're right okay so it's pretty easy to veganize this and i actually quite like it because it's not as um i don't know overly sickeningly rich because we do a sneaky swap in the um in the dressing department when I was growing up and we had like traditional barbecues we used to have a, a hot potato salad with like bacon bits and onion in it and it always seemed like it was too much effort for what it was worth because um, frying off potatoes in a fryer pan after they've been boiled to become really crispy is a lot of pros uh, a lot of processes it's a lot of steps my bad um, and it takes a heck of a long time this on the other hand is very quick and very satisfying and perfect for summer so in this uh, dressing we use half hummus and half vegan mayo and I promise you you really cannot taste um, the hummus at all you just get a lovely not as um, yeah overly rich dressing and you want to add some lemon juice to that I just didn't have lemon juice so I added apple cider vinegar instead which is a fabulous swap any of you can turn to if you need so yeah the dressing might look a little watery but I promise you it'll turn out perfectly um, when it coats the potatoes and everything and I mixed in some dill some capers and some red onion and the combination of this just gives it like a zesty vinegary fresh summery herby punch in the face that um is fabulous yes i don't know um anyone who hasn't made a nice grown a nice grown a decent grown and they've eaten it okay next one is genuinely delicious veggie skewers i know veggie, ske veggie skewers might seem like the epitome of um vegan boring um, cooking but I promise you these are actually incredibly delicious um, all the veggies become incredibly tender um, and soft and succulent and I cook these in the oven so you don't even need a barbecue it's very straightforward they cook for like 10 12 minutes and everything just sort of melts in your mouth and the marinades fab it's all very quick because I don't even have to marinate for very long so as you can see I use zucchini pepper mushrooms red onion and I also had some pineapple that I um, had already chopped up in the fridge so I use that as well and I would definitely recommend having the pineapple on these skewers um, savory pineapple it might seem a little odd but you know it works on pizza it definitely works here much better um, so olive oil garlic powder paprika mixed herbs is the base of the marinade and then if you do have it you could use a teaspoon of Old Bay seasoning or just more paprika minced garlic and then I've forgotten what was the last thing I just popped in there salt and pepper can't remember um oh apple cider vinegar again i didn't have lemon that's why i used it so when you're threading um the veggies on the stick um you don't have to soak the sticks because well if you're cooking them in the oven that's all g they'll be fine and yeah don't cut your pieces of veggies too small because they'll soften and sort of shrink in the oven and if they're too flaky they'll just break off the stick but you know keeping it small and lots of different layered vegetables looks really cool too so happy medium um the other ideas that you saw in the thumbnail were some vegan sausage rolls they'll be on a link in my blog they're really good and would be great for a barbecue um and this is also in another recipe that i think would be a fab appetizer for a barbecue it's vegan <clears throat> excuse me vegan sticky sausage which is in my cookbook and it's very meaty and satisfying um, all my grandparents and friends who tried it have been thoroughly satisfied so that will also be in the link in the description but yes trying that dill potato salad my facial expression um, speaks for it I think and yeah these skewers just oh were heaven I don't know why the marinade tastes um, so amazing it is kind of just like a I don't know, a couple of standard herbs and I'm sure a lot of you have. I don't think the Old Bay would make a huge difference if you just omitted it. Just add some more paprika or even add some smoked paprika would also be a lovely flavour addition. Um, yeah, just make sure you marinate them well and it'll be happy days. Yeah, the sticky sausage is pretty darn delicious. I don't think you're going to have leftovers, but if you did, 
it would be a fab thing to take as like in a bento box the next day to work or school or lunch or to lunch to uni wherever okay so that's it honey bunches the link to my posters will be in the description box below as well as all the recipes that were in this video and i'll see you in the next one bye